Buenos dias! Rhea Boy here and I'm back with a new vlog and for today's vlog, I'll be sharing with you my biggest online shopping haul from Lazada and Shopee this time. So if you want to see the things that I got, you know what to do. Keep on watching. Okay, so for today's vlog, it's going to be a mix of halos everything. I bought some stuff from home. Or for home. And then, of course, hindi mawawala yung clothes. I also decided to purchase from Lazada this time. And I know I told you before na hindi ako comfortable to really shop sa Lazada kasi I'm not very familiar with the app. But I'm slowly, slowly trying to learn the app. So, ayun nga, I was able to purchase some really good stuff from Lazada and I can't wait to share everything with you. So, I think we're just gonna start and I'm gonna start with... <laughs> saan ba? Oh my god, medyo nako-confused ako. Hindi ko alam saan ako magsisimula. But, I think we're gonna start with the home stuff muna and then we're gonna progress until we go to the fashion part of this vlog. So, there. <laughs> Now for the first home stuff that I was able to purchase, it would be of course the robot vacuum cleaner. This one and this one I discovered ko siya kay Tony Sia. Ayan. So this is a Tony Sia made me buy it. So ginamit ko na siya guys. Kaya may mga buhok na dito sa ilalim. Yan. Tinest ko na siya kanina and okay naman siya. Like, it did capture a lot of the fur ng dogs namin and mga alikabok dito sa bahay, sa condo. And also yung buhok din namin ganyan. But, hindi lang niya nakukuha talaga yung mga medyo mabibigat na items. Items? <laughs> mabibigat na na ano ba, dumi. But, it can definitely clean a bit. But not super naman. Somehow, it can help us na rin. Kasi sobrang dami nga talagang buhok ng dogs dito sa condo. And, nakakapagod na i-vacuum siya manually. Now, for this one, I bought this for 1,345 pesos. Not bad na rin. Kasi with Lazada, if you have a BDO credit card, you can actually pay by installment. So yun yung ginawa ko na option to pay for all of the items that I bought from Lazada para hindi siya super bigat. And yun, I just tested it out and okay naman din talaga yung payment methods din pala sa Lazada because they have that option which is great. It's cute. It's very lightweight actually. Yan. Akala ko nga hindi siya mag-work kasi sobrang gaan niya. Parang, oh my god, totoo ba to? But well, we tried it. It works. So yeah, it's nice it's a nice purchase actually and i'm so happy that we were able to purchase that one and i think it took around two weeks for it to arrive here in the philippines two to three weeks i think yeah for the next item that i'm gonna show you it would be this one actually hindi kasama yung mga necklace ko just the necklace holder ito it's made out of metal and naka gold paint shower spray and the reason why i decided to purchase one of these is parang medyo nagkakabuhol-buhol yung mga necklace ko sa loob nung drawer ko where i really store all of my jewelries and since ito medyo mga fashion pieces lang to and mabilis silang mag tarnish and napansin ko din na since i'm very acidic and after i use it i sometimes forget to really clean them or dry them before i store them so tendency is most of them nagta tarnish na agad and one time use lang so hindi magamit after. So I'm trying this one out so I'm gonna like hang them and see if mabilis pa rin silang mag tarnish after I wear them kasi hindi siya nagmo-moist. Yun yung naisip ko behind this purchase. And this one I bought for around 317 pesos. Medyo expensive or medyo pricey na siya pero not bad. Okay na rin. Ayan. For the next purchase, I have here this one. It's a phone or iPad stand. And this one I bought from Lazada for around 215 pesos. So there, it's not bad and super tight din talaga niya. Like, you know, sobrang sturdy rin niya. And alam ko talaga na like good quality siya. Kasi matigas siyang i-flip. Safe siya for your gadgets like this one, I have my iPad here. Ayan, ganyan siya. Or pwede rin naman phone. Ayan. Diba? 
Sobrang cool. I'm so happy. And ever since I got this one, my iPad, I'm always using this one. Like, majority of my time, I'm always on my iPad. It's either I'm sketching, doodling, or watching some movies or what. But yun, I'm getting a bit obsessed with it actually. And I had maybe na ako ng mga accessories niya like this one. And then I also, I think, bought a case for my Apple Pencil. But hindi pa siya dumadating. Pero ayun, bumili na rin ako ng case pang Apple Pencil ko. Para lang, when I'm traveling, secured yung, yung pencil ko. Hindi siya pakalat kalat sa bag. And um, what else? I'm also planning to buy a keyboard and mouse for my iPad. So yeah, I'm that obsessed with my iPad. Like <laughs> Now for the next item naman, I got this. It's a thermal uh, cup bottle. Wait, basahin ko na lang nga guys para tama. So this one is a stainless steel thermos cup mug thermal water bottle. I got the one in 500 ml. And the reason why I got me a thermal water bottle is kasi mahilig akong uminom ng tea sa gabi or like coffee, ganyan. And sometimes, pag sa mug lang, nakakalimutan ko na may kape pala ako kasi ang dami ko nang ginagawa. And then, the time na inumin ko na yung kape ko or yung tea ko, malamig na siya. So, parang sayang lang din, ba? So, with this one, it can somehow, you know, keep my tea or my coffee warm while I'm busy. So, the moment na nakita ko siya, ah, may kape pala ako. So, I, when I drink it, it's still warm, it's still hot, which is great. So, there. That is why I also got this one. And sobrang aesthetic niya din. Sobrang cute. Like, look at the design of this bottle. Ganyan yung loob niya. So, you can like drink straight from this cup. So, there. And instead of going for that very expensive mga thermal water bottle, although I know na effective din naman talaga yun, but this one is also effective din naman. And I don't wanna spend too much. So, this is around 215 lang din ata. And, you know, not bad for the price. And it's cute. Ayan, sobrang handy din niya. And uh, it works. So, yeah. Sunset Beach, I don't need HGTV. The next items that I'm gonna share with you would be the bags that I bought from Shopee. And I tell you, medyo na paraming atong bags na to. Kasi sobrang cute ng mga bags. As in, sobra. Like, look! Ito silang lahat. Like, I got four of these handbags. I swear, I was never a fan of avocado green before. Like, ito. Suot ko din. Pero, ang cute talaga ng color na to. Like, I'm so obsessed with this color right now. And aside from that, I also like purple. Oh my god, bakit ba? Sobrang nagiging soft girl ako lately. <laughs> but, guys, sobrang cute ng colors na to and I super love the quality of this bag. So we're gonna start with the purple bag. Sobrang cute niya and it has this parang tali na detail dito sa side and I'm not sure uh, para okay, joke. Okay, so ganun pala siya. So hindi ko pa talaga siya na-explore guys. Naka-crumple pala yung handle ng bag na to. If you pull this one and you will get that effect to your bag. Parang crumpled scrunchy bag. Scrunchy. <laughs> this one, I bought for around 548 pesos. So, ayun. Medyo expensive na yung mga bags na to na nakuha ko. Although, sobrang cute naman niya. Sobrang ganda ng quality, ng material. Sobrang... <laughs> so cute. Oh my god. For this bag naman, this one, I've already posted this sa Instagram ko like several times. A lot of you also asked me about this bag and hindi ko pa talaga na share yung link but then finally it's here. This one somehow looks like the Prada Hobo bag. So yun yung style ng bag na to which is cute and I like the size of it. Like sobrang sakto lang kasi yung Prada Hobo bag medyo may may pagka malaki lang siya onte compared to this one. And yung material niya is somehow similar na din sa Prada. This is a nylon bag. For this one, I got this for around 479 pesos lang. So, sobrang sulit na rin niya ng price. But if you're after for the whole aesthetic of the Prada Hobo bag, then this one would do. And this one comes in different colors, but like blue, pink, 
black. Yun yung mga colors, mostly pastel. And I think this one also comes in purple. I'm not sure. Actually, parang gusto ko na rin bilhin yung ibang colors. Kasi sobrang ganda niya talaga. Ay, yung asa ba yun? <laughs> now, another bag that I'm gonna show you would be this one. Itong white bag ko na to. It feels like a cloud. Like, I swear, sobrang lambot niya. And also looks like a cloud. Yung material niya is soft leather and yeah hindi naman to real leather guys so parang you know fake leather and it comes with a gold hardware super classy and ganito yung bag niya like comes with a snap button but guys this one is a bit expensive so this one i bought for around 639 pesos so <laughs> Medyo mahal na nga siya, but then sobrang gusto ko yung look niya. Sobrang ganda. Last bag from this haul would be this one. So this is the cow printed bag. Sobrang okay ng quality na to compared dun sa zebra bag na nabili ko before. May pagka patent yung material niya. Sobrang ganda talaga. Like, wala akong masabi. Ang ganda ng mga quality ng bags na nabili ko talaga. Like, hindi sila mukhang galing sa Shopee at all. This bag I got for around 569. So again, ang expensive nga talaga ng bag. I know. Pero yung quality naman nila guys, maganda. So yun yung uh, extra pay or yun yung binayaran mo rin. Yung quality ng items. For the accessories that I got from Shopee, I have this one, etong chain na to. And I just bought this for around 69 pesos. And yung design niya, may pagka-exaggerated yung laki niya. Pero sobrang cute din nito talaga. Although, fear ko lang is mabilis siyang mag-tarnish. So, kung may mga magtatanong dyan kung mabilis ba siya mag-tarnish, for me, yes. I think yes. Then, I also have this one in a much chunkier piece. Ito, mas malaki yung chain niya. Pero same store lang. Ito, same price sila. This one I got for 69 pesos lang din. So, pwede siyang gawing choker. Pwede rin medyo mahaba. So, I think yung length nito is around 16. But you can also um, wear this up to like 14 para maging choker type siya. Another chain necklace that I'm gonna share with you would be this one. This is also 69 pesos lang. And akala ko talaga this would come together. But... They came separately, so I have a silver one and I have a gold one. Nagamit ko na yung gold, and as you can see, medyo nagtatarnish na din yung lock area niya. So, there. Mabilis talaga siya mag-tarnish, guys. Like, once ko palang to nasuot. And, ayan, nagtatarnish na nga siya ng konti, as you can see. The last accessory that I'm gonna show you would be this one. This is a body chain. And I got it in silver. And this one is around 64 pesos lang. And ito yung pinaka first na body chain ko ever. And I just wanna see or try if bagay ba sa akin. That's why I got this one. Now for this next item. Remember the time na sinabi ko sa inyo na may gusto akong sunglasses from Versace. Na gustong gusto ko talaga bilhin pero sobrang mahal. Pero ito na nga. May nabili ako guys sa Shopee. And I swear it looks like the Medusa sunglasses by Versace. Like, super. Siguro yung pagkakaiba lang talaga nila would be the quality. Ganito na ganito talaga yung itsura ng Medusa sunglasses ng Versace. Although, wala ako ng original kasi sobrang mahal. That one is around 12K. This is around 329 pesos now. And it looks like the original one talaga. Even yung details dito sa side. I kid you not. As in, ganito na ganito yung itsura. And may pouch pa siya. And aside sa pouch, meron pa siya pang white ng sunglasses. Ganito. And also yung lens niya, hindi nakakahilo yung lens. Like, di ba may mga ganong fake na sunglasses na if you wear them, medyo masakit sa ulo or like nakakahilo. This one, hindi. Kailangan nyo lang talaga alagaan yung mga ganito. Lalo na yung gold hardware niya. Kasi for sure, ito yung unang-una na magta-tarnish kung gagamitin nyo siya at pinawisan kayo. So, kailangan talaga na linisin nyo siya agad and make sure it's dry and make sure that you store it properly. Para yung mga ganito mga purchases na kahit hindi naman siya yung original or hindi yung mamahalin na item, at least tumagal sila sa inyo. Sunset Beach, I don't need HGTV I want the real faith Living off your dream for the 
the first items under clothes I have here my pambahay shorts and ayan dalawa sila kasi ito itong solong item na to I got this one from a different store trinay ko lang kasi mas cheap siya like this one is around 55 pesos and then this one the whole set assorted na yung option na meron sila this is around 360 pesos and I have one, two, three, six items from that store recommend din yung mga shorts na ganito. Although, if you want ka na manipis and mura lang, this is the 55 pesos version. Ayan. And then, this one naman, mas makapalang onte yung material nito. May pocket ito on one side. And this one has a string or drawstring para you can adjust it if medyo maluwag sa inyo or what. So, ayan. This next item naman, hindi na to new sa inyo kasi I'm sure that you've seen this one a lot on a lot of people na or YouTubers out there. Kasi, ito siya. Sobrang nakaka-curious talaga and sobrang gusto ko na siyang matry kaya ako siya binili. Affordable din naman siya. Like this one I got for around 99 pesos. So not bad and I'm really curious on how it will look on me. The top is so so cute guys. Oh my god, ang ganda nito. The only thing about this top is hindi adjustable yung strap. So ganyan siya. But this one, I'm gonna pair this with a ribbed shorts. And ito yung shorts na nabili ko sa Shopee. Look at it. It's so cute. Guys, parang may pagka Jacquemus rib shorts na rin siya. It's super high-waisted. And this one, nabili ko lang for 195 pesos. Sobrang cute. And even yung details niya sa edges. And I got the size small for this one. Sobrang cute niya. And look, sobrang ganda nilang isis. Item would be this top right here. Yan. This top, nakita nyo na to sa recent post ko sa Instagram. And I got a lot of questions din kung saan ko nga daw to nabili. Kung ano yung link kasi hindi daw nila mahanap sa Shopee haul vlogs ko. Well guys, kasi kakabili ko pa lang sa kanya. And nandito na siya sa vlog na to. And here is the top that you've all been asking for. And this one I got for around 191 pesos. Next item, under the same store with the black shorts and yung white top, I got this one, a bodysuit. Ayan. Sobrang cute din nito. This one is a bit expensive na rin. Like, this one I got for around 393 pesos and this is the apricot color in size small. Next rib item that I'm gonna show you would be this top right here. This is a top from a, I think, local Shopee store. Kaya mabilis lang yung shipping nito. And, ano siya, free size. So, this one fits from small to large. Kasi sobrang stretchable din ng material niya. And for the price, sobrang sulit na rin talaga nitong top na to. This one, I got the khaki color. For the next items that I'm gonna share with you, this one naman, kayo nag-recommend ng shop na to. So, someone recommended this shop, yung CM shop sa Shopee. So, I did check them out and may nahanap naman ako sa kanila. Sobrang cute din ang mga items nila. So, I found this top. Ayan. Ito yung parang zipper top na pwede mong i-unzip dito sa top part and dito rin sa bottom part. This one I bought for around 260 pesos and I got the color white and this one naman free size siya. So, there. And sobrang stretchable din ng material niya. For this next top right here, this one, matagal ko na rin siya gustong bilhin talaga. And simple lang din naman talaga tong top na to. Para lang siyang long sleeves na crop top. Pero medyo expensive lang siya. This one I got for around 399 pesos. And this is in white, obviously. And I got the size small for this one. And ayan, stretchable yung material niya. Okay din naman yung fit. But um, hindi lang siya super fit na fit sa akin. Kasi medyo in ko na super fit siya sa akin. Pero hindi naman pala. Now, for the last items from this haul, it would be this two skirts. 
I have here. Ito naman, medyo matagal-tagal ko na rin silang nakuha. Pero again, medyo pricey rin sila kaya hindi ko sila na sama dun sa Shopee Hall Part 3 ko. Nakita nyo na to sa Instagram ko, the blue one. Although, maluwag lang siya sa akin. This one, the blue checkered skirt naman. This one I got for around 499 pesos and I got a size small for this one. Pero hindi siya kasha sa akin. Like... Ang laki niya sa waistline. So, bumabagsak siya sa my hips part ko na. And ang luwag niya, sayang lang. Pero, I'm gonna try my best to adjust this one. This one has a shorts inside. So, it's like this. Now, for this last skirt naman. This one, it's much parang mas kasha to sa akin over the blue one. And this one I got for around 499 pesos. Same shop with the blue skirt, pero different lang yung material niya, but they have the same price. Although this one doesn't come in shorts, like the blue one, like skirt na skirt lang talaga siya, pero yung material nito hindi siya kasing ganda ng blue skirt kanina. So there, we're finally done with this online shopping haul and I hope you guys enjoyed watching this one and super thank you din for continually supporting my vlogs especially tong mga hauls na to like hindi ko inexpect na you guys would enjoy watching mga vlogs na ganito and sobrang natouch ako sa mga comments nyo na you guys really trust my haul vlogs and it means a lot a lot to me and I super appreciate it and ayun nga sa mga <laughs> taong magko-comment naman na ayan, mapapagastos ako ulit or mapapashopping na naman ako. Sorry na. Sobrang sorry na. Pero, as what I told you before, damay-damay na to. So, ayun. And since 7-7 is coming. We all know na may big pa-event naman tong sila Shopee and Lazada for 7-7. So, I think Shopee has a free shipping eme. So, I'm not sure kasi hindi naman ako sponsored ng Shopee or ng Lazada. Like, ito ang mga to. Binili ko sila out of my own pocket. With this haul, I think this can be your preparation for the 7-7 shopping. Suggest ko lang sa inyo na add to cart nyo na itong mga items na to para pagdating ng 7-7, check out na kayo agad. Ganon. <laughs> so, there. That's the end of my vlog. I hope, again, you enjoyed watching this one. Please don't forget to follow me on my Instagram account. It's at IamRayaBue. Also, give this video a thumbs up. Subscribe to my channel if hindi pa kayo subscribe. And, as always, I'll see you on the next one. Bye!